Hi, I'm Lee Labrada and welcome to another edition of Lee's Lunchbox. I'm here at Labrada Nutrition Headquarters in Houston and the purpose of this segment is to show you how I eat during the day to help myself stay lean. Hopefully you'll be able to learn some uh, tricks and tips as well that you can use in your program. So without further ado, let's see what's in my lunchbox. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to put everything out here and then just kind of step you guys through how I assemble the meals for the day. So all of this stuff I brought with me and we're going to uh, step you through how to actually assemble lean body meals that you can utilize uh, to help yourself get in, uh, stay in shape. Okay, so let's start by uh, examining what I have here. Okay, I have my proteins, which are a nice piece of grilled salmon. It's got a little barbecue sauce on it. I grilled that up last night. I also have a couple of hamburger patties. Now you might say, Lee, hamburger patties? You're eating hamburgers? Well, it's a very special type of meat. It's 97% lean grass-fed beef. So these are very, very lean uh, beef patties, which I will eat probably a couple times a week at best. My other protein is a chicken breast. As you can see, guys, I'm packing these things in these Ziploc type of bags, okay? So what I'll do is that uh, my wife and I will grill these things a couple times a week, and then we'll put them in portion size uh, Ziploc containers like this. We'll throw them in the refrigerator, and then whenever I'm ready to go to work in the morning, what I'll do is I'll reach in the refrigerator, grab however many portions I need, and drop them into my lunch box so that I can put them back together uh, during the uh, course of the day. Okay, so those are our proteins. Now let's look at our carbohydrates. I've got these nice little uh, steamed white potatoes here for a complex carbohydrate. I also have these uh, very convenient containers of uh, ready-served brown rice. I like them because uh, they come in these nice little cups and that you just uh, rip open and then pop into the microwave for one minute and you pull them out and then you'll have yourself a, a cup of rice which is a perfect portion of complex carbohydrate. I also have a Chobani uh, Greek yogurt which, uh, which I like you know, because uh, it's, it's good for you in terms of uh, providing the uh, probiotic bacteria that helps uh, with intestinal health and such and it provides a nice, uh, a nice dessert. Uh, a nice alternative to something like ice cream, for instance. Of course, I have my handy lean body shakes, which I'll have at mid-morning or mid-afternoon along with a piece of fruit, uh, such as an apple. Okay, so, uh, oh, one more thing. wanted to show you these. I really like these to snack on as well. These are my Lundberg uh, brown rice cakes. And the reason that I like the Lundberg brand so much is because they're very dense and they don't taste like the styrofoam uh, type of rice cakes that, that you'll see a, a lot of times. What I'll do is I'll uh, put some of this uh, some of this uh, nut butter on there. Uh, this one right here is almond butter, but you know obviously you can pick whatever uh, type of uh, nut butter you like. Uh, the peanut butter I would stay away from, but uh, almond butter, uh, pecan butter, cashew butter, whatever you like, uh, that typically is a very nice uh, spread to put on rice cakes and helps uh, to get uh, uh, your essential fatty acids as well. Okay, so uh, without further ado, let's start assembling some of these meals. I'm going to take my plate here, and I'm going to start actually with my salmon. So I'm going to put my portion of salmon out here on the plate. Okay, and while I'm doing that, I'm going to take this brown rice cup, which we talked about earlier. I'm going to put it in the microwave, and I'm going to give it. Uh, I'm going to give it a minute. Okay, our rice is done. I'm going to take this uh, this brown rice here. I'm going to set it on the side of my plate. So now I've got one third of my plate covered with salmon, one third of my plate covered with the complex carbohydrate, which is the rice. Okay, and then on the other third of the plate, I'm going to cover that with a baby spinach and arugula salad, as you can see. I'll probably put a little bit of olive oil on that. And so uh, I'll, I'll have a little bit of, of uh, monounsaturated oil with that. So this is a very healthy uh, lunch, which you can prepare easily uh, at your place of work. You just gotta have everything prepared in your lunchbox and bring it in and heat it up. Bon appetit. Okay, so now I'm back for meal two. 
Okay, so uh, for meal two, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick my protein, I'm gonna choose a chicken breast, pull it out of my Ziploc bag, I'm gonna put that on my plate right here, and then I'm going to pick my complex carbohydrate. I had rice last time, so this time I'm gonna have these uh, steamed white potatoes. And I'll cover about a third of my plate with these, okay? And then the other third of the plate will be covered with a little bit more salad. So I've got my, uh, got my vegetables, okay? And so that is what this will look like. This is, uh, this is meal number two, chicken breast potatoes and a uh, uh, spinach and um, uh, arugula salad. Okay, so uh, this is a very nice balanced meal. For dessert, I will probably have this apple and I can put a little bit of the almond butter on it Okay, a couple of slices of that, or I might have that almond butter on the uh, rice cakes as we mentioned earlier. Or I could have this Chobani yogurt for dessert. So it's just a nice well-rounded meal. Uh, typically in the middle of the afternoon, I'll have a high protein snack. What I'll typically have is a lean body ready to drink shake. This one's got 40 grams of protein, zero grams of sugar, and it's got probiotic prebiotic fiber, and so it's uh, very good for your digestive system as well. And I'll have that with another piece of fruit, perhaps a banana or something like that. I don't have one of those today. Uh, I have apples. Uh, but again, the idea is to have something about every three hours. And as you can see, the, uh, it is necessary to come prepared. You have to uh, pack these things the night before, bring them, to, bring them in your lunchbox, and then assemble the meals very quickly at work or wherever it is that you may be uh, for the day. Well, I hope that, uh, that these uh, tips will uh, be useful for you. Before I go, I also want to tell you about a couple of uh, products that I've been using recently to help manage my body fat. Uh, something that you might be interested in is this one right here. This is orsolic acid. And orsolic acid is uh, found naturally in apple peels and in rosemary. And it's a very, very powerful leaning agent. You know, so what it actually has been shown to do in studies is to help to maintain muscle while you're dieting and at the same time improve fat metabolism. You're gonna be hearing a lot about this one and we're one of the first to market with it. The other one that you would want to know about is the green coffee bean extract. This has been shown in numerous uh, trials to really help with the fat burning process. You've probably seen it on TV on the Dr. Oz show. A great product, I've been using this one regularly and it really helps uh, you know, maintain that, uh, that leanness. And then of course I've got my lean body fat burner. It's available in the male formula which I have here and a female lean body for her formula as well. I would uh, uh, encourage you to check it out because it really helps to curb the appetite and improve fat metabolism as well. So th these are some of the things that I've been using uh, recently and which you might uh, benefit from also. Thanks for tuning in to this episode of Lee's Lunchbox. I'm Lee Labrada from Labrada Nutrition, the most trusted name in sports nutrition.